My name is Philip Price. I'm a corporate facilities analyst with an electric utility. For Arcabus, we're managing two campuses uh, in our Birmingham area. Uh, we have roughly 1.7, 1.8 million square feet across five buildings. Uh, we're using several different applications, uh, move management, space management, building operations, as well as the mobile 2.0. We started the mobile initiative uh, roughly a year ago. It's been a long time coming. It was important for us um, because our legacy building operation system was going away and we needed something to move us into the 21st century for our techs. As far as the space management, we are managing, like I say, 1.7, 1.8 million square feet. Uh, we're using the mobile devices to also conduct floor surveys to keep track of um, occupancy where people are sitting and move management to also facilitate that as well. Uh, we've been able to quantify savings in time for sure. Um, previously, our designers would walk the floor with paper and pencil, make the changes, come back, mark them up in CAD. Now we can do it on the fly with the app. Uh, we're going to be looking at the capital projects module going forward and also doing some more with mobile, uh, getting into barcoding, um, condition assessment, things of that nature. This is actually my third Nexus event that I've attended. I actually just left a session uh, on space management uh, with a local um, healthcare provider here to San Diego, which was good. During this presentation, they went through their process of implementing Archibus primarily for space management, um, showed how they use workplace transactions to track shared space um, and conduct reports showing space utilization based on visit type, based on insurance type, based on um, type of doctor seen. It was a pretty eye-opening of the different ways you can track how that space is used. Um, I'm really excited to see what we can really do with mobile going forward. Um, like I say, we're using it for um, space surveys right now out on the floors. Our techs are using it for uh, both preventive maintenance and on-demand work requests. Really want to see what we can do as far as condition assessment, barcode scanning, um, wayfinding, a lot of different aspects out there that I think we could use it for. Um, I think we're much better off using Archibus simply because it's a more up-to-date software, especially than what we've been used in the past and a what a lot of our other industry partners may be using. We've integrated with a couple of different software programs, um, an HR feed, as well as an alarm system that we have internally, and they've integrated quite well. We've been happy with that. As far as maintenance technicians, we have roughly 30 to 40 technicians who use it on a daily basis. Um, then we also have a group of about 85 to 100 users who have access as end users for Web Central who will go in and submit their own work requests. Some will submit move requests as well. So it's widely utilized. Uh, we process roughly 40,000 on-demand work requests each year, um, and then PMs, I, I can't even get a number on that one, but roughly 40,000 on-demand. Uh, we recently implemented a dashboard um, that we have up in our supervisor's office, right outside the supervisor's offices, and it shows completion rates, percentages, time uh, work requests were open, and I think that's really improved the efficiency of our staff as far as getting those handled and taken care of. We have a lot of churn in our, in our company, um, especially in our corporate offices. Uh, it was a main corporate office as well as a secondary office that we manage. Um, and we have a churn rate of roughly 65%. There's a lot of um, people retiring, a lot of new people coming in, a lot of groups reorganizing. And so move management has been really key for us to keep track of where people are going. Um, prior to... Um, using Archibus, all we could use was a Remedy software, which is actually an IT tracking software for phones and computers and things of that nature. So we were piggybacking off of that to keep track of where the employees were. And then the only real way of keeping up with where employees were sitting was based on a quarterly space survey where the designer would walk through, like I said, with pen and paper marking everything up. So. Being able to keep track of it in real time is definitely an improvement over that. Mm -hmm.